I thought it was gonna make a whistling sound. It doesn't. Konnichiwa minasan and welcome back to my channel. I have a Japan Crate unboxing for you today and I'm very excited about it because I'm starving so I can't wait to mukbang the whole damn thing. Um, also, I might be fidgeting and that's because Peanut is laying on my lap and she just won't leave and I just don't want to upset her because look at how cute she is. Okay, pee. Now, if you would like a Japan Crate of your own, which you should because they're freaking awesome and you'll see so in a minute, head on over to japancrate.com and use my coupon code RAINASENPAI to get $3 off a premium box. POW! I scared Peanut. I didn't mean to do that. That was shitty of me. Okay, I'm so hungry. <gasps> there are so many savory snacks and I love savory snacks more than I love sweets. So this is a glorious day for me. First. Pizzaji, special pizzaji, Texas corn, Texas corn pizza flavored. Okay, you got me. I want to know what you taste like. Oh, they're like little corn puffs. Oh shit! Oh, they're so good. Next, Kevitz Taro! Oh, I get these all the time at Marukai. Um, they taste a little bit like corn puffed okonomiyaki snacks. They kind of have like a sauce and seaweed flavor. It's really good. But I'm not gonna open this one up because I know what it tastes like and I'll eat the whole damn bag just like I ate the other weird corn snack bag. So I need to, you know, restrain myself. Next we have Usiyaki biscuits. Usiyaki means thinly baked. So, chocolate sandwich biscuits. Ooh. Oh no, it looks so good. It is so very thin. Look at that. Oh, this is really good. Damn, it's really good. Oh no, there's only two left. Next, sour paper candy. So, sour paper candy. Oh, they're like sour belts. You know those like rainbow colored sour belts? Well, let's see how much they taste like cola or not. <gasps> oh, they're so good. I love gummies. I don't. You know how I said I don't really like sweets? Obviously that's bullshit. I'll eat anything. Mmm. Those are so yummy! Next we have something funny. Crayon Shin-chan Jikken Drink Da. Seven. This is the seventh installment of experiment drink with Crayon Shin-chan. Crayon Shin-chan! Okay. So, Henka wo nomigasanai you ni suru n da zo. Ha? So you put water and the purple powder into the flask and then you put another mystery powder in and then it turns it into something, who knows? Okay, well I'm not gonna do that today but this seems like a lot of fun. More savory snacks. This is Sankaku Kratka. Triangle crackers, uh, vegetable flavored. A lot of Japanese snacks come in this kind of like semi-clear plastic container and it's to protect the snack shape. So it did a very good job. All these triangles are still perfect triangles. As expected, they're delicious. <coughs> Next we have Kurosato Fugashi. I don't really know what that is. Oh, oh, I do know what it is. So Fu or Ofu is this like light wafery type of snack and I guess it is uh, black sugar flavored. I think black sugar is just brown sugar. I think that's what that is. My cat just ran in. Not sure why. Oh, it's so good and fluffy. It's not really a wafer. I really don't know how to explain this one. It kind of like melts in your mouth with contact, on contact. 
which is kind of like a wafer, I guess. It's like an even airier wafer. It's pretty good. I'd rather eat the savory snacks. I don't know what the hell gotten into my cat. She's running around all over the place and like slipping around on the hardwood. Next. Mama speak. Mama speak. So, sugar snap pea crispy. I guess it's a play on those words. Well, this ought to be delicious. Oh, so they're shaped pretty funny. <gasps> oh, they're so extra crispy. Oh, it's so yummy. You can't even tell that. Well, actually it tastes a lot like vegetables, but it's really good. I'm gonna eat the whole bag. Damn it. I don't like wasting food. I'm the kind of person that like has to eat everything on the plate. Very unhealthy. Very unhealthy lifestyle. I'm not gonna lie you guys. I'm getting really full and it feels fantastic. Next. Huh? Mitarashi fumi. Kibidango. So this is supposed to mimic a traditional dango. It does not. Not sure what this is. Oh. Oh, okay. What the hell? All right. Not quite sure what this is. We're going to experience this together. Is it oburato? I think this is edible paper. I think you can go right through this. Oh, yeah, you can. Oh, wow. Not sure what it is. But it definitely tastes like mochi, and it tastes like the sauce of mitarashi dango, which is made out of, I think, soy sauce and meeting and sugar. Um, so you've probably seen it in a lot of anime, but dango is uh, three mochi, like rice mochi balls on a stick. And usually it has anko, which is red bean paste on it, and it's a lot sweeter, or it has a mild savory kick to it, which is the mitarashi dango, and it just has, like I said, the soy sauce meeting and uh, sugar mixture on top of it. It's a sauce. So that tastes, this tastes exactly like that. I just, the packaging is off-putting because nobody, I don't think anybody knows what this oburato paper is who's not Japanese. Um, you actually wrap a lot of powder medicine in this so that you can just swallow it instead of taking it in pill form, which is, I think, just like a really archaic style of taking medicine. But anyway, this is in candy form, and it is quite good, but it's definitely weird, but I really like how weird it is. Check it out. Mm-hmm. It's yummy. It tastes just like it. But weird. And next, shitori matcha. So shitori means, like, dewy, if you put it in makeup terms. It means, like, wet and moist. So these are moist matcha biscuit crackers. Mmm! Oh, okay. It does feel moist, but in the right way. It's like a crispy cracker, but it's almost as though there's cream on it or in it. There isn't, but feels like there is. Damn, that's good. I'm a huge matcha flavor fan, so this is fantastic. Oh my god, I cannot eat too much more. I'm getting so full. Next. Natsukashi ramune! Natsukashi means nostalgic, which makes a lot of sense because ramune is one of those dagashi old time snacks and it's really popular during like the obon festival season and like uh, summer festival seasons. Um, and there are a lot of beverages that have ramune, or a lot of candies actually that have a lot of ramune flavoring. So yeah, these are little ramune sugar candies in a cute little ramune bottle. Love it. Okay, we only have a few more things left, which I don't know if it's a good thing or a bad thing because I already ate so much food. Oh, this one's a beverage. Mikan soda. So an orange soda of sorts. I really want to taste this, but I don't want to taste it unless it's cold, so I'm going to stick it in the fridge and have it later. Moguchu. Chewing candy. So, mogu, chew. Okay, 
Mogu Mogu is the onomatopoeia for chewing, like Mogu Mogu Taberu. Basically like Nom Nom, I guess, would be the best way to describe that. And it says it's a chewing candy. Since it's a candy and not a gum, I'm assuming it's like a taffy. Oh, okay. Maybe it's like haichu. Haichu nano kana? Ichigo aji. Strawberry flavored. This literally looks like a haichu. Mmm. Oh, I got it. It's harder than a haichu. Which makes it a lot chewier. That's why it's called Moguchu. Because it's more chewy. It's really good. It's just every time I chew down, it gets stuck in the crevices of my teeth. But then it catches it again. And then it gets stuck again. Swallowed and next lemon chan amazupai ring candy uh lemon chan a sweet and sour lemon candy <gasps> Ooh, okay it's in a ring a little bit like a lifesaver mmm I thought it was gonna make a whistling sound it doesn't it's actually really big for a candy. Like, it's really big. It takes up a lot of my mouth. I can't even, like, shove it to one side of my cheek to hide it so I can talk. It just takes up the whole thing. And finally, Confeto! You pretty much see Confeto everywhere because they're basically little baby rock sugars. I think there were some in the other box as well, but these are in, like, a little mini container, little mini package of them. Um, what I like to do is, when I have fancy guests over, I like to put this out instead of regular sugar because it just simply tastes like regular sugar, so you could put it in your coffee or tea and it just looks really cute. Kawaii! Kawaii tea party! And there you have it! I am so full that I just want to lay down and take a nap now. Uh, obviously, if you get a Japan crate of your own, don't eat it all in one sitting. That's a waste! Even I didn't really eat it all in one sitting. I just opened all of them and ate like a butt ton from like each little thing, which is also just such a selfish, sloppy, nasty thing to do, but I just had to because it's all so good. If you'd like a Japan crate of your own, head on over to the website and use my coupon code RainaSenpai for $3 off. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know in the comment section below which snack interested you the most. My favorite snack this time has to be... Oh, you know what? I really liked the triangle vegetable snacks. I really enjoyed these. I love them very much. They're very tasty. They feel kind of healthy because they're kind of like biscuity. Um, and they're really tiny, so you aren't consuming too much of it in one sitting. <laughs> but yeah, let me know which ones interested you the most. Thank you again so much for watching, and sanja matane!